to another video. So today and tomorrow I'm going to be looking at the magical uh, add-ons. Today I'll be looking at uh, Elemental Cross and come back tomorrow for a look at magical magic spells add-on. Yeah, let's get into the world. See what magical crops has to offer. Of course. Um, tiny trash can. I have not cleared my inventory from the last video. Uh, I forgot to do that. Them in there. There we go. Right, so we have a book for the elemental crops add on. Welcome to the elemental crops add on. This mysterious world is home to five unique elemental essence. Awaiting your discovery, start by finding the seeds, plant them on the farmland, and use a sprinkler to grow the crops. Elemental crops will only grow when they're a sprinkler or from using the bone meal or water essence. Once harvested, you'll unlock the power to craft incredible gear and useful items for your adventures. Get ready for an enchanting journey into the magical realm. There we have essence seeds. Essence seeds thrive in the native environment across the world. Cultivating these seeds into fully grown crops yields essence. Yields essence. Crucial for crafting the purposes. So we have earth essence seeds. Can be found below the surface when mining ore blocks. So we gotta go diggy diggy hole. Diggy diggy a hole. Where's my helmet? Like, I seem to have somehow misplaced them. Oh well. That's the problem for future me. Walk all the way down here. And I'm just gonna dig. Oh. Uh. One, two. See if we can get some of these uh, seeds. I have played a little around with this a little bit uh, in my own uh, world. Not much, I've got some air found at uh, water. From my experience, uh, the air seeds are pretty rare. Not like super rare, like you can get a fair few of them just from doing a bit of mine, but they're not super common. I've done, I have done uh, a ton of mining and only got like two air seeds. So, not going to be drowning in these. So, if you find them, uh, save them. I tunneled like through a mountain and I got like two. Uh, AFC. Hey, it might have probably been a better idea to go like find gold. There's a cave. There. Yeah, the world I can probably find some more. Yeah. I seeds up them. Yeah, I can always get them. So this is probably going to be a long one. Uh, nope. Yeah, I saw a hole there. I'll see if it punches a hole. Uh, just going to uh, come up here. Uh, About eighteen. 
Ah, there's coal here that Oh, but so a bear chance perfectly. Uh it doesn't say where if like rare walls have a bear chance of blocking them though. Or if like beta walls they have a bear chance of blocking them, so Seem like the best uh, way to get them then if they if all alls have the same chance of dropping it is just by mining a bunch of coal and copper and a little bit of iron. You get fairly large veins of them. One lucky you just get two. say specifically also I don't know if it sorry, I'm, I'm just gonna assume that's only all drops it and not uh, just like digging deep We got one air essence seed. So yeah, it's for wars. And I'm being shot at by a skeleton. Yeah, we got two seeds, uh, big enough, I suppose. Don't want to spend like an hour mining. Got a couple, there'll be more. Uh, show off all of this. We've got essence seeds. If essence seeds, what's the next one? Seeds. There we have F. 
Oh, Ender, we just Ender. Exists within the end dimension by defeating Endermen, Endermite, Shulkers, and, and, and the Ender Dragon. We're off to the, I'm off to the end again. Now, um, I think I mentioned this in the technical one. Uh, after recording the Mutants uh, mod review, I was in my storage area that was just down down there, and so, for some reason, the mutant zombies, a uh, mutant zombie, saw me through a wall and decided to chuck a you know, thing of TNT at me, blowing up my redstone chest, part of my sorting system, and myself. I didn't die. Uh, even though I was AFK and they could have done a bunch of damage to me, apparently they just didn't. They just like chucked one big TNT at me and then just left me. So, yeah, I had to download another copy of the world. So, I don't have the end portal here anymore. Which would have been nice, actually, for this mod, but I'm gonna have to see you again once I've gone to the end portal. Uh, I'll also let Lily out while I'm at it. So, uh, yeah, BRB. Right, so I went to the spawn hole, I got the end portal, I brought it back to my base because I'm probably going to need it in the future. Uh, so, yeah, let's go to the end. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to mine up some endstone and I'm going to do a safe area for the endstone. It's going to be too difficult to get some endstone real quick. I have a loot in three diamond sword, so shouldn't be Also, some people will, before I get any comments asking why I don't just cheat in, I think uh, the reason why I decided to do the, the uh, a copy of my survival world is to basically show like how, uh, give you like an idea of like how difficult uh, the, these add-ons are, or mods or whatever you want to call them, um, and like what kind of engine you're shaping them on uh, to do it. And I try to do, because uh, I've got like, a lot of stuff like that in this world, like it's fairly late game. I, so you know, I've beaten the end dragon, some people have beaten end raiding, so, got a lot of stuff, like, I'm going to back again. The thing is, there's like a school boy right next to the station here, like the hill. some boats. I know like the uh, boat trick doesn't work quite right on bedrock where, as on Java because it's bedrock on my like, arm. Uh, no. Like on Java and then actually uh, block out the boats. I killed that what uh. I 
swear they get angry at you when either one is looking at them. And just looking at you. Uh, it is, uh, I was about, yeah, I was talking about the boats. Uh, it is still handy because they are momentarily stuck. So I'll get myself for a couple of boats to show uh, it off because there may be some uh, people who don't seem to know that. So this one's not the boat that I started. Oh, wow. Wow. He not to the port out of the boat. Yeah, so that's why it's handy because they do sometimes just not teleport out of the boat and you can just see it on them. But usually they just teleport out straight away and. They are still handy when you're killing endermen, just keep them still for a few seconds while you get a few hits on them. It would be nice if they just did teleport out of the boat. It's a bit glitchy. Oh. Oh. just teleport out of the boat straight away. Oh. Oh, there you go, guy in the seats. Got one, let's get a few more. Hey, over here. I'm looking at all oh, yeah. Too bad, man. You know, I do have illusion free, but I'm not exactly sure if it does or does not affect it. It did not say that. Uh, I'm gonna say that if looting does affect it, it's not too bad. If it doesn't affect it, then it's pretty good. Can you die, please? Let's stab. 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 I'm leaving. So now we've got the Ender Essence. I'm really interested to see what you can do with this. More because um, the Java one by the same well, not the same name, it wasn't Telemental Crops, it was like uh, Magic Crops. And it did, you could do some fun stuff with them, like throw diamonds and stuff. But let's see what we can do. Uh, I'm excited to see what we can do with the seeds. Now, we've done uh, Air Fire, uh, Air Fender, now we're on to Fire. 
in deep in the phase of the nether dimension, when mining nether quartz and nether gold ore, it can also be collected from defeating creatures from the other nether. Eh, easy peasy. Let's go to my horrible nether spawn. There goes my mine. That I've been playing some like uh, modern stuff. Yeah. Bitch. Bitch. Oh my god, it's been so many years and I've still not optimized. Which is still laggy. Yeah. Um, and I've got enough view from Kalinka. Like withers and glazes and stuff, so you can uh, definitely get them that way. Fire essence already, just one fire. Okay, just one. Uh, that wasn't never quarter, it was never gold. Or... Anyway, 
This is this will be enough. But yeah. And yeah, a lot of mining to get. So I would probably recommend like you know, fortress, especially if you like going for uh, river schools. Whatever, because. Probably get a fair few before he goes. For that is probably going to be the most annoying to get because you gotta kill flying enemies. Now, there aren't that many flying enemies in the game. There's the ghasts, the bats, and the, the phantoms. So, if you have a phantom farm, good for you. You're gonna, you've, you've got an easy source of it. I don't know if, I've actually wanted to build a phantom farm just out of sheer hatred of phantoms. I kill as many of them as possible. As the fishing spear as possible. Oh, see, this is how I am. I don't know if that's yet. SNCs. Cover water SNCs by exploring underwater depths by defeating the beasts well in there. Now, this, unlike the others, this one doesn't give a list of them, but I assume this is. Well, I know you can get that from the rounds because that's where I'm in. Uh, so, I know there's an ocean in this direction. This is uh, the direction of the guy You for the mutant fruit. But the damage isn't there anymore. I had to remove the meeting creatures and they put all my storage. Bear in mind, I dug this tunnel about uh, the bodies. Right. And also, I did have a fucking one. Why is there a random dead? Oh, an Enderman right there. I just heard him teleport away. He's like, ha uh ha. -huh. Ranked, yeah. Yeah, digging those tunnels. Wow. I miss my light truck. Come on. Yeah. At P E I the light truck. Myself rockets. Yeah, firework rockets. Do these actually work? Oh, yeah. Uh, Let's see if I can. I don't think you'll be able to get them from fish. Uh, you might get them from like, uh, the, um, what do you call them? Ah! Guardians and Elder Guardians. Put that there. Oh, eight round. Come here, I need you to die. Die for me. Do me a favor and die. Here we go. Interesting scene. So you can get them from. So you have a. Oh yes, I suppose you get them like fish, squid, dolphins. 
fish squid, dolphin, brown, the duck. Uh, maybe glow squid. Yeah, probably glow squid. And, um, uh, guardians, elder guardians. And all those lovely aquatic assholes. Oh, I'm just, uh, um, I'm just like reminding it. I, I was like scrolling through you. Yeah, yeah. I come across like this floor, there's like, oh, I can't remember what it was, but there's like this like, tiny wizard that's like a dog for companion. And like this, made, made this guy super tall. Like a bit is like, and he's like, get out of the way, you large beige ass. I don't know why well, that made me really. Yeah, you're yeah. land based bastard, that's it. Yeah. There's all the time with a British accent, so I assume the guy's. Dead. Actually, I should probably see the best. Actually, not win. Uh, essence seeds. Water, yet yeah, win. Change from creatures with flight such as phantoms, bass, bats, gas. Oh, yeah, you can get bees, LAs, parrots, and vexes. So, we're going to summon some phantoms. Yay, they are quite annoying to get. Um, um, bam. Get back here. Get here and hit me. Come on. God, I hate phantoms. Come on. Come on, get here so I can stab ya. Okay, now after this, phantom. kill something else. I probably wouldn't recommend killing gas with this because gas drops tend to lava. What's your other gas drop? Yeah, probably get building like a gas drop or phantom farm is probably gonna be the best way to get. Oh, yeah, he drops them. 
Got wind doesn't sleep. Probably don't need to kill him kill him after kill him yourself. You should probably just like not sleep for a while, let a bunch of sad pants in spawn and then leave the game to take and then die. Anyway, uh, let's see if we can get someone the Hey, come here. Wind essence seeds. Yeah, if you have a bee farm, you could probably like breed up a bunch of bees, get them in a in some like beehives and bee nests, and just kill them off. Separate area. Um, so the uh, wind essence seeds are the most difficult of seeds to get. Now we have all of the seeds. Let's get found up air. First, before we do that, I do craft. Before we craft. Yeah. Uh, what should we call it? The sprinkler. I do remember why you need to craft up the sprinkler. So you need uh, three iron ingots like that, a water bucket. Let's get filled with water. Then we craft it up. Crafting table. Sprinkler. Uh, I'm just gonna add that. Like that. Yeah. I can also put a torch on it. Handy. Also, this way it is handy. Handy, dandy. Seeds, so this will be yeah, all I need off to go out and get this off. And let's just keep Damn, you. Well, let's get these seeds planted. Lived in I was until the fire. Anyway, no. <laughs> so these are the seeds. Let's just not say like what area has to be in, but I'm assuming that it's just like same like, area as like water irrigation. If not, that would be very annoying. And yeah, these do take a while to grow, uh, and I can tell you that from experience, because like I said, I've been messing around with this in the world. World. And yeah, they, yeah they, they, they do take a uh, while to get them to grow. But if you remember, the book says we can also grow them bone meal. And thankfully, I have a skeleton farm right here. And I didn't do three and a half out of skeleton. 
This is why you wear the helmet. <laughs> I float off them and I don't know if I suppose to drag them to wherever fully mature. But yeah, that's pretty much how you can do it. Yeah, I guess these are. Like, I don't, these don't make sense for like, the design. Like, they, they don't make like no sense. Mm. Like, that kind of looks like a hurricane, but. Mm. I, I obviously don't know what you would do, but the other one. Like, end of pearls. Sense. Something else I have also noticed, uh, also you, on like regular crops, you can pickpocket them, is that they usually only give one step back. Not all the time, but usually, like, it's all there, like, and we got uh, an extra seed from one. So, if you're only starting off with one seed, it will take a long time to get going. This is probably like the biggest downside is that, yeah, they do. ones you can do is sea lantern with four water essence and a torch which I think that is pretty cool uh, and if you're on a um, uh, well, I was about oh well, yeah if you are on a super flat world that's the only way you're gonna get in mind my bedrock that's the only way you're gonna get sea lanterns because you can get uh, tropical fish and other fish from one of the rooms at sea kill them for the water essence seeds and then get the water essence out of them uh, but that would take a while uh, Play from two air essence. Uh, you can make end rods from three end essence, which is nice. Again, uh, the only way you're going to get uh, end rods in super flat because you can get end in the other world. And three wind essence gets you a feather, which is eh, and you can probably do more because, like, sand you can, you can do like wind and air. I probably just don't have enough essences. Also, you can make a water bucket with a water bucket and water essence. Like, what sense does that make? I think they did. I think that's a bug and it's supposed to be an empty empty bucket plus water essence. It makes sense, but it's still kind of. Mm. Mm. And if you're on. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm probably going to end uh, the recording here, not this recording, but I'm going to stop here for a little bit, do a bunch of uh, bone meal and uh, get a bunch of uh, essence and then I'll be right back. There we go. So yeah, see you in a few. Oh boy, that took a fair few minutes. Uh, from my experience, each um, each fully grown crop gives you uh, one you know, essence. That's without fortune. It might be a thing by fortune being the problem with chicken. Um, check that out. And it's it. 
clap. Show me like a clap. Authority. Cost anywhere between three to four. Bone meal. So yeah. Well. Tune, so yeah, and they also take a while to grow when you when some of these are fully grown, so it's not going to take super duper long, but you might want a good amount of bone meal uh, to see through this because now we're going to want to make these into ingots, and to make them into ingots, uh, sorry, we need to make them, into, yeah, we need to make them into crystals first, sorry, which requires nine of them. How about the crystals? So we make them into crystals. So I've got way too much iron. I forgot about the crystals. Crystals. Then we make the crystals into ingots. Then we make the ingots into. Yeah, I'm a server. Like I, I, I got like a, like I show you, I got a stack of the uh, type, and that's only got me like three ingots. So yeah, this is gonna take you a long, long time to get all of the uh, ingots that you need. So I'm just gonna. Uh, give myself a bunch of ingots because I I have stuff I want to do. I don't want to spend the next couple days bone mealing these. So yeah, you're gonna want yeah you're gonna want a lot of seeds. This is this is gonna take you a long time and a fair bit of iron because like each of you cost only one iron as well. There is also the elemental ingots that you want, which is crafted because there's also the elemental ingots. Which is crafted from one of each ingot. So, we are gonna need a lot of ingots. Um, so, I'm just gonna give myself a stack of each. Uh, of each. So, I'm just Got 64. 
Says for each, no tools, and we have blocks. So, boots, chest plate, head, and leggings. Recipe. Boom, 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 boom. Now, all of these will give you some sort of effect. Uh, let's. So, Earth gives you strength, and I think also gives you knockback. So uh, let's just, uh, I don't know, let's summon a, uh, I don't want to summon a creep because that's just going to blow up skeletons. Uh, spit. 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 Uh, yeah, of course it's going to launch a sharpness fire. Oh, oh. Oh, I accidentally turned RTX on. That is annoying. Uh, video. Ray Trace. Spider. One. Two. Yeah. Oh, this is pretty good. Spiders has twenty. Spiders have twenty HP. And I killed him. Nah. Well. I must set. And I can't. Can I have twenty HP? Am I mistaken? I'll summon a zombie because I know what zombie. One. Two, three, four. So that's four. Uh, one plus four, two plus four. Five, ten, fifteen, twenty. Yeah, so you're doing about five damage with your hit punch, with your punch. So yeah. If I just give myself a diamond sword, give that to P. I am. Yeah, do you make my sausage fingers? I'm summoning another zombie. <laughs> yeah, you can one shot with just a regular diamond sword. So I'm just gonna put one in there. Well, yeah. let's uh, check the mock back. <laughs> Let's open an Enderman. Who <laughs> shot an Enderman with a sharpness five sword? And they have like double the health, I think it is, like a regular player. You basically. One shot in the regular player every day. Air set. Let's move on to the next. Do you want to play a. Uh, no tools or swords. Uh, I, uh. Oh, fire resistance. Yeah, pretty basic. Oh, I forgot to check it out. So, yeah, Earth is basically better than Dying. Fire is not quite as good, but if you're in the nether, I can see, I can definitely see fire being used. Uh, because if you go into a lab. 
if you get him into the forest, which is probably not there, if... The if one is failed. Because it's better than diamond and it gives you strength, so yeah, so about strength. Let's see what other water does. It gives you oh it gives you conduit power and water breathing. Okay, a portable conduit and it's almost as good as diamond. So yeah, if you if you're in the water a lot, this is yeah. Um, definitely like second best to, uh, uh yeah, let's go into the cage and fly over to the ocean. Yeah, if you're working around water a lot, this is actually Pretty good. Game mode zero. There you go. Oil breathing in mine, the water is in my land for one. Actually, you might be a little bit, yeah, you're a bit slower than mine on the world. You probably want, uh, can you enchant these? Oh. Uh, that's something quick I'll test out when I get back to the base, because if you can enchant these, then, yeah, they're going to be really, really good if you can enchant them. Ace bar. Enchant them, yep. Yep. Oh, let me just. Huh? Yeah, not gonna. Yeah, so. It, yeah, you asked. You are. Uh, let me just get myself in the channel book to make sure we can do it in survival. Let's get. Yeah, I got an anvil here. Oh, I did. Yeah, you can. Yeah. Okay. The these are really good. Yeah. They're but well, they are going to be mostly like when you're around water, working around water and in water. But having a, basically having a portable conduit is really good. It would be really nice if they also gave you the dolphin's base effect as well. That would be perfect. Yeah, we. 
Uh, so we did air fires, and now we need to do air. Then we'll do ender. Oh, it gives you speed, jump boost, and slow fall. That's pretty cool. Not bad. Slow falling's a little bit annoying because I just fall slowly. But you know, you're not going to take any fall damage. And speed is really good. And the fact that it's not much worse than diamond. Yeah, decent. Definitely see why someone would pick this over the air farmer. Well, I still think the air farmer is better. Opinion. Now let's see what ender armor does. Attacking enemies away, uh, it gives you resistance. So like uh, it makes it so that you don't float up. Chalk attacks and uh, it gives you resistance to end. So yeah, this is a good ender set if you're going ender. Chalk, hit me. Okay, so it doesn't give you immunity; it just gives you resistance. But you are definitely, I am definitely going up slower than. I normally would. Um, oh, I don't have leggings. Why do I not have leggings? Was I just mistaken? Oh, I thought she went up a bit faster. Maybe. So I was recently watching like. Damn it! I was recently watching like Mumbo's um, end raiding. End raiding. So. I thought maybe levitation effects. I don't know, but I thought that's just mistaken, I guess. Damn it. How did I miss the leggings? Okay, Shulker, hit me again. Now I can see it how. Oh, hey, no, you just pop over. Okay, so yeah, it's really good for any. Because one of the most annoying things is. Yeah, it took like two of them hitting me at the same time for any levitation. And summon a zombie and see a spider. A spider. Drop in the seas. Summon spider. Summon spider. Hit me! Oh, wait, I need to punch him. Oh. Yeah, he gets teleported away. But not the most useful thing because then you gotta find them again. Mm. Let's see why that that can be bad. Not so bad.
Let's check out this because the other man is so I assume these are going to be the strongest. Hey, what, do, look, what do the elemental ingots do? Uh, not essence. Back. Elemental. Oh. Uh, elemental ingots are uh, crucial in crafting. Floating powers as elemental crystals additional as effective resources for repairing your elemental gear. Yeah, but you could just enchant it with mending, probably. Oh yes, here we go. How am I missing something? Oh! So you, you don't use the elemental ingots to craft the elemental armor, you use... Others plus chains. Okay, that's odd. I don't know why you wouldn't just use the elemental ingots. Okay, game. Now I'll check out the elemental blocks. Uh, in a minute, once I've got all these crafted up. Uh, chains just require iron. Get. Cut. Uh, Pretty sure it's just got to be seven. Right. Boots. Got some leggings. I need to put the chest back. I need to put the chest back. Ah! Do they do not count if they are enchanted? There we go, chest plate and helmet. They have two wind boots. Oh no, there's five, so yeah, you don't need the wind boots. from the other armors so yeah this, this is definitely the best one but this is like end to end game like this will take a lot of work for you to get yeah it is really good um, uh, being interrupted. 
Okay. So, yeah, obviously, this is the most powerful armor. It's got, you know, all of the effects from the previous. Uh, yeah. Ah, what do you call it? The previous uh, armor sets. Can they still be enchanted? Uh, trips me up because it's the inverse of I'm pretty sure every other command. With every other command you do XP, you do XP at P. So I think breaking that you can do that. Breaking. Breaking. And obviously you can like protection as well. Break. Projectile blast by a regular. Cool. And they've also got like an Aqua Infinity. So I got. You don't need Feather Form, but you can do like. Um, soul. Soul Speed. I know you will probably want to get spider, not salt. Don't need respiration. Um, you will want swift sleep, though. Affinity. That uh, makes you like faster on the water. And of course, all of the protections. Don't, you'll never need fire protection if you have fire resistance. Yeah, hold on. How much armor does this give? Let's try. We have the boots. Uh, did I? Oh, I need to go to the river. So, boots do two and a half. Oh, wow. Well.
I'll just give myself time now. Quick. Yeah. I um guess plate. Sound exactly the same. This gives three and a half. This gives three, so that's an extra half. Leggings. Same with diamond and the same with chest. The chest plate gives the same. So you have one extra armor protection than diamond armor. You also have the. So yeah, this is uh, a clear bit more powerful than regular diamond armor. Would be nice if I could craft a sword that. Uh, is just like that's one thing like these add-ons have like been missing. It's like you don't get really like I've not really seen any cool like the dragons one which is probably one I'll do soon. That one that gives you some cool swords. Mm -hmm. That's gonna be a bigger one. But yeah maybe magic. Maybe the magic might give us give us like spells mm -hmm. to back with. Um yeah, hope you guys oh wait I forgot to. I was gonna show off all the uh over that. Show off all of the element blocks. Here now. But yeah, out to the arm um, says I say probably the earth one is the uh, best, it was the exception of the elemental armor, and there's no reason to make any elemental except unless you want to use the elemental armor off. Um mm. Yeah, let's get four of each block. Take a look at them. So we've got F. Ah, uh, yeah. Water. There's water. Uh, air. I like the sound that the air makes. It's, I know it's just a snow sound. It's still nice. Ender. Oh, I like Ender though. Oh, Ender's the uh, amethyst. And the elemental. Yeah, they're pretty much the same textures, just with different shades. Kind of like a metally look, but I this does look nice. Like, uh, if you want to use these as like uh, sort of like metal block, like the other one does look pretty cool. Like, I can definitely see you doing some cool stuff. Hold oh, well, on, can I? Uh, let's just grab a dish. Please make it sound. Oh yeah, they do make a nice sound when they're that. Well. Yeah, pretty cool blocks to be honest. It would take you ages to uh, get enough essence to Okay, so you might want to start up a really big farm of the essence that you want. Yeah. Other than that, I hope you guys all did enjoy. So hold on, let me just make absolutely sure. That there are no new swords. One. 
Yeah, no new swords. No new. Oh, wait! You have a wind axe. No swords. Wind axe. No pickaxes. No shovels. No so, hopefully, this is like a sign that they're going to add more stuff later on. Take a look at the wind axe. I don't even think the wind axe was even mentioned. So it's probably not even craftable. Essences, essence seeds, sprinkler, element <coughs> seeds, earth, ender, fire, water, wind, element, ah, my uh, da, da, da. Yeah, no, it does not, it is not mentioned. So it's. Let's just take a look in the crafting table. Can you craft this up real quick? Wind. No, you can't even craft it so yeah hopefully this is a sign that they're gonna add tools and stuff in so let's get hey it's night time apparently, yeah, apparently gives you night vision even when you're not underwater oh that's actually pretty good then i thought that the conjure only gave you night vision when you're in the water but no it gives you night vision all the time that's it. That, that actually makes the water set even better actually. uh let's grab some bone meal and some uh, what happens and see how this. If the wind axe does anything special. I doubt he'll do anything special because, uh, like I said, I, you can only get what you create at any point. So, probably. Not do anything special. And, sapling. Here. Grab some bitch. <laughs> and let's see if the index is anything special. Bits of ah. Capitator is. Probably was literally just like added at the last minute because they were like testing out the idea of like adding elemental tools and weapons, but they never like got around to finishing it. Yeah, I would really uh, like them to update this, and uh, uh, what I would like to see, what changes I would like to see. Well, I don't know if it, if you should just craft the elemental armor with elemental ingots rather than all. But that would make it more difficult to get, which is kind of good. But yeah, I think that's definitely something they should think about. At least. And ooh, let's let's think about like what the elemental tools and swords would do. So like an element, well, elemental swords. Well, have the element. Well, so obviously the element mental would uh, do all of them. But like I think. Anything. So, wind. So, well, let's do swords first. So, swords should put law and up in the air and do some more damage. Uh, if. Hmm, I don't know. Not really. Like, maybe. Instead of going up, they go down, they get buried in the ground. Maybe. Uh, fire, obviously, we'll just like fly them on fire. Water. Hmm. What would water do? Maybe the water. Well, actually, instead of like doing all of them, they could have like the elemental sort of uh, water, 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 water. I don't know what water could do. Yeah, that would just viable. That. Yes. Um, 
if it's a creeper, what it could do is it could stop them from exploding. That would be cool. That would be nice. Ender ingots will obviously like teleport them away once you hit them. Now for like tools, for like pickaxe, axe, I guess. Win. Ah, that that is difficult. I see why they didn't. Um, why why they didn't had. It's quite difficult. I guess like wind will give you like haste because I'm pretty sure that's the one that gives you speed. Like will give you haste when you mine. Because even though I have haste right now, if I walk away, that's from the beat. So, yeah. So could, that could give you haste when you're using the tool. If in ditch could. Like, I don't know. Fortune, maybe? Fire. Oh, fire could auto smelt, so that would be cool. Water would. I don't know. What would water do? Water would. Oh, if you break it, like, this could, this would be a shovel. Maybe they only handle you with a shovel, but, like, if you're mining, mining sand or gravel, uh, you, that sand and gravel would die. Have, so, like, oh, if you're breaking stone. It would turn into uh, gravel, then if you break gravel with it, it would turn into sand. And uh, uh, that that could be. Or uh, if you break sand and gravel with it, you have, instead of getting like sand, gravel, sand or gravel or thin, you would get um, like iron, or iron, or copper, or I mean, like a diamond or, a, or an emerald or something like that. And the uh, um. There's also quite difficult ender ingots. Um, ender ing oh, what? Ah, yes! Oh, here's a good one for ender ingots. The blocks that you mine with them, they teleport to you. So, you know, if you break, so like when you break an ore from like a distance, it'll teleport you straight, teleport it straight to you. And like I said, elemental ingots will probably just like. Uh, have a, like, have, I, I think, yeah, obviously, like, if there's conflicting, conflicting effects, it would, like, have a chance of conflicting effects, maybe, or uh, just doing all the effects at once. But, yeah, that's pretty much everything. And like I said, I am excited to see if they do decide to update this. Uh, favor. and if they if they if they do and there's a, like a major update which does add tools and stuff, I will definitely come back and do a part two to this review because it is a cool uh mod honestly. So, has some cool stuff and like I said, not many of the add-ons that are coming out do have like weapons and stuff. Have the uh this is probably gonna add them later on, which will be cool. So uh, yeah, hope you guys all did enjoy this video, hope to see you guys in the next one, and uh, uh, bye!